Hi everyone, my name is Rujuta. I'm the co-digital and fashion editor at Vogue.in and today we're going to talk about an exciting new launch from Dyson, Dyson's new hair straightener, the Dyson Coral. And joining us this evening is none other than celebrity hair and makeup artist Namrata Soni who has her own academy and uh, if you frequent our Instagram channel you must have seen her very often. Uh, she was here a few weeks ago to talk about the Dyson Air Wrap. And today, Namrata is going to take us through all of the amazing features of the Dyson Kral. So bear with me while um, I add her to this live. And feel free to send in any questions. Uh, we'll be answering them at the end of the live. Namita should be here any minute. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm very well. How are you? Very well. Just trying to figure out where you can see. Yeah. Okay, cool. How you been, Rujita? Been very well. How about Super you? Super excited you for this live. Yes. Uh, we've been playing around with the Coral a little bit at the Vogue office and we absolutely love the machine. Uh, but, you know, we have quite an audience here this evening uh, who's excited to learn more about the features. So, um, over to you. Yes. So, um, I mean, this is the machine that I have. Do you also have this beautiful purple machine? Indeed, I do. Ah, isn't this the most spectacular color to it own? Is. I mean, it's stunning, right? It looks okay. delicious for some reason. <laughs> it is delicious. That's so well said. Okay, so, I mean, you have been working with it. So, you know what an amazing machine it is. Uh, but mm. to say a little bit about the machine uh, is the fact that anything that Dyson does, I've been with the Dyson uh, family now for a few years. I've always been a part of their launches. And I've also been using their products for very, very long. And what I loved about the Coral when they came out with it and they sent it to me was the fact that it is A, really easy to use. And secondly, it's, it looks after your hair. So for someone like me, uh, work-wise and personal, I do straighten my hair. I do uh, shoot a lot. Um, it does only 50% of the damage, unlike a conventional straightener, which is literally burning your hair every time because the reason why that happens, I just want to quickly tell you, is that it's got this amazing uh, flexible plates. One of the reasons is the flexible plates. So it gathers your hair very beautifully when straightening it. And it's got an intelligent heat system, a heat control system. So that means, let's look at the iron. This is your straightener. And this button is how you push it up to open it. Yeah. Okay. Now you switch it on, you switch on the power button. It shows you that your battery is fully charged. A fully charged battery will last you for like 30 minutes. Yeah. Okay. And then there is this telling you to now choose the setting you want. So you have 165, 185 and 210. That's so right. the intelligent heat control system, how does it work? So say I choose for my hair, 185 okay so it's on 210 right now i'm bringing it down to 185 so it is first going to heat up and when it reaches 185 it gives me the information by a beep and a tick mark saying that it's ready to be used so how does the intelligent heat system work correct like that is that if i've chosen 185 it is a con it is consistent at 185 the temperature does not fluctuate Unlike right. a conventional straightener, which fluctuates constantly. So you may have chosen a temperature of, say, 185 or 210 on a conventional straightener, but the temperature is never steady at that temperature you've chosen. So it's either fluctuating really high above or really low. So your hair right. is never getting the even heat that it needs to do the job of straightening. So that is one of the most beautiful things about the Coral. Like it really looks after your hair. It really, really uh, uh, only does 50% of the damage of a conventional straightener. It is super easy to use. And for me, of course, it's cordless. So super easy to work with. I've actually used it a few days ago when I was traveling in the car and I had to go for lunch to my in-law's house. So I quickly straightened in my hair in the car and my husband's like, what are you doing? You know, so it was actually quite a lot of fun. Uh, but uh, let's start, I think, by um, sectioning out our hair. You have sure. beautiful curly hair, so you're a perfect model for showing the corral. We have a challenge ahead of us, don't we? It is not a challenge, baby. It's going to be amazing. 
Okay. okay, so let's start by first sectioning out the hair. Okay, yeah. so you take your middle parting, do ear to ear section. Okay, so you take your ear section in the front, and you clip it away. Okay, so I'm just going to take a little bit more. This is a really attractive look, guys. Watch yeah, out. it is, isn't it? Okay, and just make sure that you clip it away by twisting, so the section is nice and tight. Yeah. And I have lots of colorful clips today, so I'm really going to look very funny, but loving it. Okay. Why not? And clip it really tight. Okay. There. Okay. Now the second side. Always do the back first. Easier because it's also a lot more hard work to do the yeah. back. Okay. The front is relatively easy. Agree. Okay. In comparison, in comparison, I'm not saying in life. No, it also just really makes it so much easier for someone like uh, for someone with hair like mine to manage it. You know, honestly, sometimes I give up on styling my hair just because it's it's like you don't know how to handle it at the end of it, and you're just like frustrated. And then, oh, my hair is getting stuck in my hands. Yeah. Okay. So that's the front section done. Now I'm gonna go down the back from the center and part it. Okay. And I'm going to clip away the section I am not using, so it doesn't come in the way when I'm working with the section at the back. Okay. Absolutely. And always brush out with a comb or a paddle brush your hair before you start straightening it. Ah, uh, Namita, do you have any tips for like how to sort of prep your hair before? Yes, before of course. It? So for someone like you who has curly hair. It is very important to remember that when your hair is wet after you've showered it, put a smoothing cream in your hair, like a lisp control or a smoothing cream, and then just paddle brush. You get this like a light, nice big paddle brush. Just paddle yeah. brush your hair so that right. there's just a little bit of smoothness. It'll never make it completely poker straight or anything. It's just a little bit of smoothness in the hair, which will allow your straightening to be done faster, and it will keep that uh, because curly hair has a tendency to bring back into Absolutely. its curl the bonds are very difficult to break so you have to make sure that you are constantly so you've done that and then once you start your hair once it's dry take a little bit of a serum and just put it all over your hair before you start straightening it right always straighten your hair in a controlled temperature environment so like in an ac environment super yeah. important to remember that Okay, you cannot do any kind of hair styling in heat. Okay, even if you're doing it for someone who has straight hair, you cannot do it in heat. Okay, yeah. so now I'm taking this section which I have done. Okay, so I've taken out this section at the back. Okay, yeah. now my uh, coral is at one eighty-five. I'm taking it as close. The beauty is that because of the rounded. Uh, the the flexible plates you can go very close to your scalp and now just see how slowly i am coming down literally at a snail space so you have to also for you get put your hand here up here uh rujita no up here oh. hold it it doesn't get hot and now slowly put a little bit of tension and bring the iron down okay if your hair is coming out, you can always go back and redo that section. Okay, so you will actually see if you hold it and you give it that tension on the top, is when right. your hair bond starts sleeping. Yes. Oh, that's how it works. I mean, yes. honestly, because what other happens thing is about. Sorry. Yes. Sorry. So, because what happens when you have curly hair? See, I have straightish hair, so I can right. go down with one hand without putting too much pressure. But because you have curly hair, your tension in your hand needs to be enough that you're allowing that to sleep. You know, so your your the, the curly bonds are going to sleep and they are becoming straighter. Can you see that? Now, I would go over once again on this section. Okay, so when you're doing the top, just see what I'm doing. I'm just coming once, twice, thrice, and then coming back slowly again underneath. So that is the area that always has a bump, stays right. flat. That's it doesn't so go awesome. flat. Look, 
look at that shine. Okay. Yeah, look at that shine. It's gorgeous. So now I'm taking my second section. I'm just going to leave this at the back here. Yes. With the duck. Okay. So now I always take a little bit from the back section, the section that I did before, so that I've not missed a single strand of hair. So just a little bit from that section, which will blend in. Yeah, a little bit. Now, again, go close. Hold it there. Come down at least two, three times. Just midway. Allowing the bonds to sleep. And then holding and giving tension. You're coming straight down very slowly for your head. I can still come down way faster. Because I already have straightish hair. Yeah. But you will have to come down way, way slower. But I have to say, even then, it's so much quicker than anything that I've used before. Uh, because yep. uh, I almost have to do my hair twice, you know. Um, <laughs> yeah. And uh, so you can actually see how beautiful your hair is looking. It's looking so like shiny, you know. And yeah. for curly hair to look that hair. shiny straight, normally it lands up looking very dry. Yep. The other great thing about this iron, I have to say, is that um, your hair doesn't get stuck in the plates. There's no sort of yeah. breakage that happens. I was um, just going to ask you that. That, you know, my, my hair normally used to always get stuck between the plates here and yeah. break. And that breakage is not there with these flexible plates. It's quite amazing. And also, it doesn't get so hot that you can't hold your hair. Yeah. Like with a conventional yeah. straightener, I cannot hold my hair after I've done that section. I have literally lost all feeling on my fingertips. Literally, yeah. I have no feeling on my fingertips since the last 15 years. Because I've literally burnt my fingertips with like straighteners and tongs. Right. No, this is really uh, the temperature like you're saying. Like I can, I can touch it and it, it's... Yeah, see, I'm comfortably yeah. touching my hair. And I'm now increasing the temperature to 210 so that I get a much more slicker and much more, um, uh, you know, beautiful straightening effect on my hair. Should I start on another section? Yes, please. So how do you go? Do you go um, like... I go side, but I, I do the back first. I will always do the back first. Okay, so I'm still doing my last section over here. Okay, so again, guys, hold it down so that it gives it enough tension. But the beauty is that because of the flexible plates, it will never close so tight on them that you have to worry that your hair will get caught. So you can actually see how lovely that looks. I'm going to anyways do my top section and show you guys separately. Okay, so now I'm going to my right side taking a section you know in so a do you salon, find it comfortable exactly. or do you need to change your hand Vijita? uh so far i'm good with this hand i haven't really you know especially because like you said it's cordless it's not really bothering me to move it yeah um in any way and makes um, a huge difference yeah and i'm able to grip it so well here with my hand that it's almost effortless yeah Sorry, you were asking me a question? No, I was just about to tell you that normally it takes about like two hairstylists a good hour to blow dry my hair. And yeah. I can't be doing this by myself. Um, it's and imagine doing this in 30 minutes. The charge of this is 30 minutes and I think you can straighten your hair in 30 minutes. I've practically all but given up trying to like style my hair at home. I just put my hair in a bun and go out. If I, you know, I love my curly hair, but sometimes it's just that you want another look. Sometimes you want to do something different, you know. Yeah. Like for me, I love curls because I have straight hair. <laughs> the that grass always is always the greener on the other side. Always. Right? Always, always greener on the other side. Always. So just remember, Rujita, when you want, and especially all those people out there who have curly hair, if you give the right amount of tension in the front and hold it with both hands, you will always get a tighter straightening effect. Yeah. And also what you showed me about just going over the uh, the base 
a couple of times over yes. because uh, you know with curry hair it's especially more stubborn at the base and, oh yeah um, for sure the hair has a so, mind of its it is really important to actually go over that base a couple of times so that's what i land up doing like especially towards my roots i just go over it a couple of times so that i get a very very tight straightening and the hair goes to sleep beautifully if i feel like the hair has gotten too thick like in the sense the amount of hair i will i can restart from the center and continue going down that's a lovely finish there yeah that's a gorgeous finish so you can actually see that there's no frizz in the hair and it's looking so lovely okay so now let's start with the other side in the front are you done with your back i'm almost done with my back ah okay i seem to have a lot more hair than normal people do i yeah because you also have curly hair curly hair is of course a yeah. lot more um uh, you It's know volume yes yeah. so you have to yeah So yeah so if you guys want to ask me a few questions in the meantime I can answer them about the coral the straightening normally should last you till your next hair wash uh, but because of the heat and the humidity that we live in in India you might have to go over it the next day just really lightly with big sections and especially for people who have curly hair people who have fine fine or slightly wavy hair it's very easy you might not need to do anything but for the girls who have curly hair even if you have a conventional straightener you will always have to go over like slightly thick so instead of going over your entire hair you'd have to take a section like this and just quickly in the morning just slowly go over that section so that uh, straightening will last you till the next hair wash to be honest this iron is so much fun to use you just want to keep using it yeah it is and what i like is that uh, you know somebody actually sent me uh, this thing saying oh is it 30 minutes really less as um uh, you know the cordless time and i'm like actually no you can do so much in 30 minutes it's unbelievable yeah i mean 30 you minutes if you can long time if it won't give you this result exactly and if you who has such curly hair can straighten your entire hair without charging it in 30 minutes i mean that says a lot about the straightener yeah and i love that you're not like tied next to basically a plug point somewhere the whole no and you know ready. and you know what happens with the plug point also is that half the time it gets stuck in your hair or half the time it um uh gets stuck in your face so it's like you're trying to move the wire and half the time because you're trying to move the wire yeah you don't land up doing a good job because you're so scared that the wire is going to like short circuit or something for me that's like my biggest issue you know i get so yeah. scared and the yeah. other thing like you said like you can take it with you just put it in your bag and like if you're running late yeah. for a meeting or something you can just quickly do your hair on the way yeah and that's what i land up doing most of the time honestly can you see what yeah it's looking so lovely and and look how straight and shiny your hair is looking it's so lovely so now that this also comes with a little like a uh, flight mode can oh my god that is an amazing amazing feature so it comes in a flight mode means can you see this little airline button here so if you unplug that the battery right. gets disconnected so you can actually carry this in your handbag when you're going on a flight you don't need to check it in which is half the time we get so scared because our stuff breaks in check in yeah so you can actually just disconnect this okay so the plug comes out and there's a beautiful case there's a beautiful case that it comes in okay that's the case and it's got a little pocket for the airline oh, tag yeah and uh, it just works brilliantly it also comes with this which is the charging dock so you yeah. can actually just keep your uh you know iron on it and it can charge while you're working cordless or if you don't want to work it or if the battery is going you can directly connect it magnetically it connects to your iron directly so if your battery is dying but you're still in the middle of curling your uh, uh, straightening your hair all you need to do is just Rest apply the battery directly to that yeah i mean i honestly point. like using that stand just because it's so convenient and it's oh you, you know the tool heats up and it, it's just so much more yeah. easier for anyone to use it it is and also what happens is that it doesn't uh 
Uh, you don't have to find places to keep it. You know the amount of sofa tops and countertops that I've burnt in my life with irons, because the edge of the iron will always burn it. I have burnt so many countertops. It is okay, unbelievable. Gosh. Your furniture will be thankful now. My furniture is thanking Dyson right now. <laughs> Trust me, it is thanking Dyson. So even my grey hair, which I have, the really really stubborn grey hair, gets beautifully straightened because that's the hair that's frizzy and annoying. Yeah. Do you have any recommendations to just generally reduce frizz? Uh, you know, with hair like mine, that's a major concern. So you know, there's something um, called water therapy, where you right. can basically for seven days you have to allow you have to allow your hair. Uh, so stand under the shower. It's just that it's you know, as as people in India, we don't want to waste so much water. So yeah. basically, what you have to do is that you have to stand under a shower for um, ten minutes without applying anything in your hair, and allow the water to seep into every strand of your hair beautifully. And, and after like have seven that? days, you have to do that seven days, and you have to wash it every day. Hmm. It, it really adds. It it basically brings back. All the moisture into your hair, especially for people with curly hair. It is a very, very important. Uh, a lot of people don't know. It's called water therapy, hydrotherapy. Right. You know, and then what you do is basically you just shampoo your scalp, and you put your conditioner twice. Yeah. You put the conditioner twice in your hair. So you first take the conditioner, apply it, rinse it right. off. Again, apply the conditioner, rinse it off. For curly hair, you can of course use a white tooth comb when your hair has got conditioner to make right. sure that the um, there are no knots in the hair. Okay, so always, I mean, I'm sure you already know that as someone who's always had curly hair, that you need to always comb your hair when it's got conditioner in it. You cannot yes. ever brush or comb your hair uh, without that. No chance. Okay, so you can actually see the shine, and you can actually see how. Beautiful and shiny, my hair is looking with the curl. Okay, so I'm now gonna go in for the last section on top. The clips damage your hair more than anything else. <laughs> okay, so don't be in a rush. Take your time doing the sections, Rujita. Yeah. The bottom section before this has not been done properly for you, so you need to go back and take tiny sections, which is where your clips come very, very handy for you. Yeah, the case is lovely, definitely lovely, guys. Uh, so um, one of my favorite uh, is the L'Oreal List Control. Uh, right. The cream, it's a beautiful cream for list control. It's a beautiful smoothing cream when you want to straighten or blow dry your hair, especially if you have curly hair. Uh, followed by either a Moroccan oil or an argan oil for your hair. Puts back the and moisture. Sorry, you were saying? Sorry, I said it puts back the moisture, and at the right. same time, it just. Does not allow the frizz to come back, especially after you've straightened your hair. That's that's another important uh, thing, you know, just to like make it last for a little longer, um, and for your hair to not look so staticky in the end. Yeah. Required. But you know what's really lovely is that this iron doesn't give me any static, which is a yeah. big big thing for my hair because I'm constantly getting a lot of static in my hair. How often do you recommend someone use this in a week? You can use this without fear of damaging your hair at least three times a week, and that says a lot. And I know people who straighten their hair every day, you know. <laughs> so I would use it. I mean, if you are someone who likes that straight hair but does not go in and opt in for the chemical treatments, which is of course really harmful, you can use this uh, at least three to four times a week. Just make sure that you use a heat protectant spray or serum in your hair before you start. So any of those products have to be used on wet hair. Allow it to dry uh, with the hair dryer. So basically, pre-style your hair slightly, and then do your straightening or tonging or whatever it is that you want to do.
Namrata, there are a lot of questions about where do you buy the iron. So you should, you can buy the iron on Dyson dot India, Dyson dot in, and they have uh, two different colors. They have a nickel and fuchsia, and they have this beautiful purple color. I love the purple. The purple is beautiful. It's my favorite one. And also, what they do have is they have a low, no cost EMI option. So you can pay for it, not in one shot, but over a period of a few months, and right. uh, you know, still avail of the iron and still get something that you love and want to do for yourself. Oh, you're almost you're done already. Almost, almost. I don't have as much hair as you, Rujita. That's. I also have much finer and straighter hair, like wavy hair, not straight. I would say, yeah. So, you know, yeah. Okay, let's see the questions. Would you, you suggest wet control or heat protection spray or both? Uh, definitely do both. So, on your wet hair, you will first apply your mist control, and uh, then uh, once you comb it out, you will apply your uh, heat protect. Uh, blast dry your hair if you want to blast dry it, and then um, after that you will uh, continue with the coral straightening. Okay, so now for my front, I actually like to just go straight down so that I've not missed any spots and my hair is beautifully, evenly straightened. So this is just to give that extra finesse. And I'm just curving this inside so I get a really lovely effect in my hair when I open it out. Love that. So I get That's like an out flick in my hair. Yeah. I'm almost done. Yeah, but just look how your hair is looking. It's so beautiful. And, it's and this has not even been 27 minutes. That's it. It's just been 27 minutes, guys. Air wrap or straightener? Okay, they're both different. If you like that salon, blow-dried look and effect, you will definitely opt for the air wrap. But if you want that slick, poker straight look, you will opt for the corral. Yes, it's beautiful and you can see the shine. So I had so much of frizz uh, in my hair and now I just have this beautiful shine in my hair with the product. And I've not put any heat protector, I'm uh, sorry, I've not put any kind of serum or anything in my hair. Uh, Namta, isn't there a lot more that you could do with the iron in terms of... Oh, you know, get like a there is of so it? much more you can do. I'll show it on my hair while you are uh, spacing yes. your hair. Okay, so one of my favorite, favorite things to do is do a lovely little curl with this. So you take a section of your hair. Uh, so these are like those very Bollywood, Hollywood curls that everybody likes to do. Okay, now I'm just gonna turn my iron 360 degrees and now very gently glide this down. Okay, again, very slowly, allowing the heat to spread evenly and do its job. So you'll actually see this lovely bouncy curl in my hair. Can you see that? Oh, that's great. Yeah. And then you can also, so this is one of them. Then you can also, if you want to, you don't want to do like a complete straightening. You can just take the iron and you can flick just the ends of it out. So you basically yeah. curl it 360 degrees once and you get this beautiful out curl in your hair. Can you see that? Yeah. So all you I need love to do that, is actually. You can't? I actually love that. Yeah. So you're just curling the ends of your hair. Just remember to use a hairspray when you are doing any of these things because you are now changing uh, the bond of your hair. So from straight, you're now going to curly. So you do need to remember that you need to keep it. You need to do a little bit of hairspray. But even when this opens out, the curl is really beautiful and fluffy and big. So it looks lovely. It looks so nice. Yeah. So I do a lot of things. You can even do like finger waves, you know, like you can do beach waves. You can actually do, take your straightener and go. So basically 180 degrees 
and then right. bring it back outwards another 180 degrees and then again twist it inwards 180 degrees and let go so can you see the kind of bounce i get in my head so it's, it's like a big especially wave. because of the yes yeah, because, because of the, the rounded rounding, so it looks easier exactly so if you actually see my hair i've got this slick beautiful fully like just my my you know top section is curled outwards and then i've got this really bouncy but at the same time very shiny volume on the other side so it's a very out of bed beach beach kind of vibe hair which you dry but you just have to you know you've you've done it with a straightener <laughs> oh my god look at that it's unbelievable i have poke straight hair Yes, and in less than thirty-one, no, thirty, twenty-nine minutes because we were talking. Twenty-nine for minutes. minutes, we made it. <laughs> yes. So again, like I just want to show you guys. So if I don't want this, all I have to do is just get, go back over it, and very, very slowly take out the curl. And now I'm going to match it to my other side. So I'm going to turn this three sixty degrees, just towards the last two inches to get that beautiful out flick on my hair. so my hair looks really trendy very very modern at the same time and very slick i love how it frames your face also you know it really yeah so even you can do that you can just you have to just lift it and curl the outer corner so just okay so i'm going to show you again so this is your section front section of your hair you take it okay now hold it with both your hands rijita okay, okay. and start sliding it and now rotating it upwards when you start coming down not now so keep coming down keep coming down keep coming down now start turning it yep twist it more 360 degrees twist twist slowly and yeah and now slowly let go okay when you reach the end oh look yeah. at that it's so lovely so you can do that to all your sections of hair so the curls just go one into the other and it looks really beautiful that's like straight out of a lookbook straight out of a lookbook and the beauty is that just remember you need to just put a little bit of hairspray okay because okay. this is something that we're doing after straightening the hair so you need to just keep it in place so what i do is i just spray it i let right. it cool down for like maybe 4 to 5 minutes till to touch it's nice and cold like it's room right. temperature and then you can go and brush it out a little bit if you don't want it that very stuck so like if you see my hair i have tons of layers in my hair you know yeah. so when i do it i get a very beautiful out out you know uh, out curl effect in my hair so like if i do it even on the top section if i go in the bottom section and i keep just twisting the last 2 2 and a half inches into a 360 degree turn I get like lots of these beautiful, you know, layers in my hair, and it looks really beautiful. It looks like I've gone to the salon and blow dried it into an out curl blow dry. Yeah, and imagine to be able to do this at home, exactly like, with like very minimal effort. You don't need to make a salon appointment. You don't have to wait to get that chair. Experience you don't have to do you any of that, and you can do it in the comfort of your house. You can, you can, uh, you know, make sure that you are putting the amount of product you need in your hair because you never know what's actually happening, you know. Yeah. So, and then you can flip it, just so that you get a little bit more volume, you know. And because I've curled it, out curled it, I get like lots of body in my hair. Your hair, looks you know. Beautiful. So you can do it either way, depending on what section and what side you want. So I get lots of volume. So this is literally like what we try to achieve when we're doing like you know fashion shoots and stuff. And it's so easy to do it, and especially for uh, artists out there, it is yes you can. And someone's asking, can a thirteen-year-old girl use it? As, yes, you can. It's very easy uh, to use this uh, product. So yeah, I mean. you know guys definitely check it out so uh, rujita what do you think do you love the product i love it look at the shine that is another challenge i have you know with curly hair like your hair to really shine is a big deal um yeah and i, I so I what you can do is that you can now take a little bit of a serum like a one and a half pump if you have of a serum and uh, yeah so just take one and a half pump of it pump of it and push all your hair back Okay, and hold it in a ponytail, like a high ponytail, and just run it through your entire hair. Okay, so gently, and then bring it back to the front. Okay, and then whatever is left, you can just go into your hair. 
from the top. I love. Yeah. I mean, it just looks so much more healthier. And even though it's straightened, it's not dry, and it doesn't yeah. look like you know it's been chemical. It's been like it's got. too much heat damage that for me is the biggest concern when i use straighteners and hair dryers and you know tongs that there's so much of heat damage that's happening to the hair that when you have okay. a product which will make sure that you don't have that much heat damage why will you not opt for it i know it's an expensive machine um it's for 36900 but the beauty is that it is available on no cost emi options so you can pay for it over a span of time and enjoy using this machine Absolutely, and it's a one-time investment, you know. The one-time investment. I love how Dyson, you know, really marries beautiful technology with great design. I mean, what look. technology? I mean, look at it. It's and and the best thing is you can put it off, and immediately close it and lock it. Because a conventional straightener, you would have to keep it open for the plates to completely cool down. Right. You don't have to do that with this. So you just. switch off the machine so you switch off the power button and you close it and then you can put it into your pouch and yeah. you are ready to go and even though it is slightly hot inside it the pouch is heat resistant completely you can just slide it into your bag it's i mean i want to show it off personally if you have an eye on this good looking why not <laughs> exactly my point exactly my point you know so it works so well but i'm so glad that you actually did this rujita because you know you have the perfect hair for people to see that it is very very possible uh you know for you to do a straightening on your kind of hair which is very curly and has a little and has quite a bit of frizz in it if i'm not mistaken absolutely does it's a lot of which hair is why you're so constantly keeping it curly because you're like you know whatever it just it's too much <laughs> time and effort to straighten it that's that's so true you have no idea so my my one thing with for you would be just remember and i'll say you go to sleep and you wake up and you've got a little bit of a wave don't get right. stressed right. just take your straightener slightly bigger sections you don't have to go over the tiny sections you did just part your hair into six sections and just go over it once and the hair will go back and settle into the straightness sounds about like a plan i'm i'm I glad like i i can wake up like this tomorrow basically you can <laughs> And, you can uh, and and remember that you know it's all in the flick of a button and it's battery operated it's cordless so a lot of somebody asked that if they don't have power just make sure you charge it in 30 minutes is enough to style your hair completely whether it's straightening or whether you want to curl your hair or whether you want to give it an out flick uh, effect or whatever it is that you want to do yeah someone's really worried about hair fall i can report that nothing is caught here So yeah. there is no hair fall, guys. So don't worry yeah. about that. I all. mean, if you naturally have hair fall, it is going to fall. That yeah. has nothing to do with the straightener. Exactly. But nothing gets caught in the straightener for you to get worried about. True. I hope you enjoyed this session, Rujita. I, I did. Hope I... You taught me so much about hair today. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god well, we never get time to do this on shoot so finally we have gotten time to yes. like learn how to beautify ourselves no way to go but such beautiful hair and yes. i'm going to go home to my husband and you're going to be home with yours and we're just going to be having a very fancy dinner at home notice anything different about me today <laughs> thank you so Hi. much for having me vogue and thank you so much for having me rujita and uh, thank you everybody uh you know for joining in and i hope you guys enjoyed this session you can shop at dyson.in and you have a low cost uh no cost emi option available for you to shop it and remember that it's 50% less damage than conventional straighteners so here comes beautiful hair all the time thank you so much namita bye bye